You're going to start by putting your image into Photoshop and unlocking the layer. Make sure your image has some nice dark areas and light areas as this makes the effect work the best. Once you've added your image, go to adjustment layers and add a gradient map. Once you've added your gradient map, let's edit the gradient and add 4 more points. And make your gradient look like the one that I've already created. You can even move around the colours to get the perfect thermal effect. Now I'm going to select both layers and convert to a smart object. Command or Ctrl J, I'm going to duplicate the layer. Then go to Filter, Blur, Gaussian Blur, and we'll make that about 20. Then we're going to click here where it says Normal and go to Lighten. I'm now going to select both layers again and convert to a smart object. Now I'm going to go to Filter, Pixelate, and Mosaic. Now using this slider you can change the pixel effect to your liking. Once you're happy click OK. I'm also going to go to Filter, Noise, and Add Noise to create this more grainy effect. Now that I'm happy I'm going to rasterize the layer. I'm now going to do Command T and resize it as I think it looks better more zoomed in. And that's how you create a thermal pixel effect in Photoshop.